and death and hell were cast into the lake of fire. This is the second death. And whosoever was not found written in the book of life was cast into the lake of fire. That's a loving and holy God that is long-suffering, that is not willing that any should perish. But in the pages of the Bible he has put forth, Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, and thou shalt be saved. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son. And you can choose to receive his Son. Or you can choose to reject his Son. But the Bible says, He that has the Son has everlasting life. And he that has not the Son shall not see light, but the wrath of God abiding upon him. Your eternalness after you die, and there is an afterlife. It's heaven or hell, and you don't go to heaven automatically. But what you choose, what you do with Jesus Christ, if you believe, thou shalt be saved. If you reject, thou shalt be rejected. God's love is that he gave his son to be our sacrifice. The Lamb of God which take away the sin of the world. But if you want to have your own payment for sin, you want to rely on religion, God has a place for cleansing. And it's in the lake of fire that burneth forever. You see, Christ has already bore our sins. And you need not to bear them if you're to put your faith and trust in Him. There is no other name under heaven given amongst men whereby you must be saved, you must be born again. But in the must that God has given you an option, you can choose life or you can choose death. But believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life for God sent not his son into the world to condemn the world but that the world through him might be saved for what is a man profited if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? What on earth could you possibly offer God to get into his heaven? What on earth has a sinner, for the Bible says all have sinned? You got a holy God and you got sinful people. That's not a combination. The Bible says there's none that doeth good, no, not one. The Bible says, He that has not the Son, capital S-O-N, Jesus Christ, shall not see light but the wrath of God abiding upon Him. Heaven is not automatic. Heaven is not by membership. Heaven is by the precious blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. For God sent not his Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. He that believed on him is not condemned, but he that believeth not is condemned already, because he hath not believed on the name of the only begotten Son of God. Neither is there salvation in any other. For there is no other name under heaven given among men 
whereby we must be saved. It is a biblical truth that Jesus saves. By the power of Jesus Christ only. By the name of Jesus Christ. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. For with the heart man believeth unto righteousness. With the mouth confession is made unto salvation. Now the Bible says go in all the world and preach the gospel. That Jesus Christ suffered and died according to the scriptures. And was buried. And arose again the third day according to the scriptures. I have no problem preaching the gospel. My mouth is just filled with the mercy and grace and the wonderfulness that Jesus Christ saved my soul. And it cannot shut up of what Jesus Christ has given me and offering to you eternal life. It's also a fact is if you are to reject Jesus Christ, if you do not have the Son, you will not see life. You will see the wrath of God. And that wrath of God is hell. You can die and be buried and wake up in hell without Jesus Christ. Or you can die and be absent from this body and present with the Lord by Jesus Christ. For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son that whosoever believeth in Him should not perish, but have everlasting life. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, and thou shalt be saved. Resist God, and He'll resist you. Reject or deny Jesus Christ, and you will be rejected of God the Father. 